Hello, hello, Kenny Evans here. We got a very interesting video. And the topic of this video is bring up sex early with women. But before I get into that, as I always say, I want to let you guys know this channel is not just about dating and relationships. It's also about health, wealth, and mindset. And of course, if you like that kind of stuff, as well as if you've been here for a while, you know, definitely hit the subscribe button, hit that notification button, uh, so you'll be notified when I upload new videos. And if you just like my videos or if you like to support me, hit that thumbs up button as well. You know, what I mean, I definitely, definitely appreciate it. So, let us get into this topic. Bring up sex early with women. It's very important that you bring up sex early with women so you do not get a woman uh, who is just uh, using you for your time or potentially money but has no intentions of getting sex or giving you sex you know what I mean and you don't want a woman who is has no sexual interest in you spending too much time with you because she will benefit and you will not so first and foremost First thing you got to do is you got to figure out if she's sexually attracted to you. Very simple. You bring up sex, and if she's down for it, I mean, it could be when you first meet her, say, hey, I'm just looking to hook up with you, just looking to have sex with you, friends with benefits, fuck buddies. Or it could be, you know, when you're on your first date, say, hey, you know, I'm not looking for anything serious, kind of have friends with benefits, fuck buddies, have sex casually, hook up with you, whatever you want to say. You got to bring that out early. You know what I mean? And if she's down, cool, cool. You know what I mean? If she's not, you have two choices. You can leave or you could kind of, you know, uh, attempt to seduce her. You know what I mean? And that really brings me up to my second point. See if she'll adjust if she isn't initially very highly sexually attracted or if she has some sort of barriers you know so if she says oh well you know I don't really know you that well or you know I, I rather get to know you a little bit more or I don't normally do that you know again you have the choice you could either leave or you could attempt to seduce her and if you are able to seduce her hey you know I mean I'm not really looking for anything and you know how, how much time do you really get to know do you need to get to know somebody you know when you can feel the the, the the attraction. So I always say, I, you know, I, I could tell you feeling me. Obviously, I'm feeling you. You know what I mean? So I don't know what's the hold up, but you know, whatever, whatever you gotta do to seduce her, to get her to, um, you know, see things your way, and for her to want to go along with it. You know, um, but of course, you gotta understand. Um, you know, you could always have that trump card. You know, and leave if you have to. Or just tell her, hey, whenever you change your mind, give me a call. You know, um, so um, after that, you know, granted she, she agrees, you're able to seduce her. Um, you got to always, this is my third point, always lead the interaction to what you want. And this is after you've already, you guys have agreed to have sex, you all have had sex, you know what I mean? Maybe she'll catch feelings, you know? Um, and in theory, it's a good thing, but if you're not looking for a relationship, you just want to have sex and keep it casual, you know, do your own thing, you got to let her know. You know, she brings up the relationship, let her know that, you know, it's not what I'm looking for right now, you know what I mean? And, um... You know, uh, let's just continue doing what we're doing. Maybe down the line, uh, we could uh, get in a relationship. Or if you're looking for a relationship, she brings it up. Say, hey, cool. You know, I've been waiting for you to, uh, you know, bring that up. You know what I mean? And, uh, you know, I, <laughs> yeah, I always wonder what took you so long. <laughs> you know, say, hey, you know, I've been looking for that too. You know, just wasn't sure where your head was at. So, <clears throat> But yeah, whatever it is, lead the interaction to
to what you want. It is very important that you do so. You know what I mean? And because she will respect you if you do what you want to do and you don't give in to what she wants. And over time, you do give in if it is truly what you want. She will respect you. You know what I mean? And again, it starts with bringing up sex early because now she, again, she knows what you're interested in. She knows what you want. And over time, now you're, what you want is, has changed and she knows it's genuine and she could trust you and she, she could uh, follow your lead because she knows you'll keep it real with her. You know, so that's very important. Lead the interaction to which, to where you want it to go. Um, of course, you have to always um, be willing to leave if, you know, ultimately she is not uh, down for what you want or if she's constantly pushing you, pushing you with what you want and you told her that it's not what you want but she's constantly pushing you. Uh, you know, in reality, you should always only t- have to tell a woman one time um, something that she's doing wrong or something that you don't like that she's doing or um, that you're not down for something. You know what I mean? Um, and, of course, you know, when it comes to relationship talk, you tell her once, maybe, you know, six months, a year down the line, she brings it up again. You know what I mean? Then, sure, you know. Um, but not immediately. She can't be nagging you every every day or every week or every month about it. You know, what I mean, that that's 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 a red flag. You know, so if she's constantly nagging you, you got to be willing to leave after you've told her. Or if she, you know, um, doing stuff that you don't like, you got to be willing to leave. You know, what I mean, and the beauty again, all this ties back to bringing up sex early because you she she could trust you. You know, what I mean, she knows you're the leader. She knows you're going to tell her what you want and what you say is true. You know what I mean? And um, then she'll be able to follow that lead, you know, because she, uh, because of her trust and her her her, uh, her interest in you, you know. So, and obviously, you want to be well-rounded and all this stuff, but her sexual interests, and then whenever you see, you, you show her other aspects of her, of you, that she likes... I mean, she's just going to fall in love, you know what I mean? Um, So, uh, bringing up sex early is so important because it's really the foundation of your relationship. Everything else branches off of that, you know? So, uh, but yeah, if you have to leave, you have to leave. And the fifth point is you got to, or, yeah, fifth point is you got to always realize that you can get other women. That is super important when you realize you can get other women, because when you realize you can get other women, you're not gonna be able to, you're not gonna put up with as much of the BS. You're not gonna put up with the BS, period. You know what I mean? And you have a little bit more of a confidence because you realize, hey, if things go too far left, I could, I could be gone. You know, I, but I'll be all right. You know, and in bringing up sex, because I gotta tie all these together, bringing up sex early. Um, it's just because again, you're gonna bring it up. Come hell or high water, if she's down for it, cool. If she's down, not down for it, cool. You go, you leave, you find another woman. But of course, again, you want to see if she's adjusted. And if she doesn't, you leave. You'll be fine. You know what I mean? And again, that's why it's so important. You know, um, you gotta be living life on your terms, living with your truth. You know, so um, you you realizing and having that abundance mindset, know you knowing you could have other women, you're just a lot more free. You know, you realize things will be all right if things don't work out with this girl. So, yes, 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 that's all I got for y'all today. You know, let me know what you think. Like, comment, subscribe. Of course, hit that notification button. Um, if you agree with me, cool. Let me know what you agree with. If you disagree. Cool. Let me know what you disagree with. Um, if you even if you want to dislike the video, leave a comment as to why as the reason you dislike the video, so I can adjust for you guys later. Uh, you know, in future videos. You know, um, and of course I always bring this up. 
let me know what other topics you want me to talk about. Again, this is not just a, health, a dating and relationship uh, channel. This is a health, wealth, and mindset channel as well. And of course, this channel is for you guys. So I need your input to let you, to, so you guys can let me know what you guys want. Because this channel is for you guys, not even me. You know, so. Um, and with that being said, I do appreciate, you know, donations. Any amount counts, you know. If you enjoy this video, I do appreciate it. Um, but yeah, I guess that's pretty much it. You know, until next week, y'all always realize and remember the strongest man is the happiest man.